Hello again, it's Priscilla Batzel at Spring Hill, Florida at Expressionist Art Studio Gallery. And I was once swipe obsessed and now I am temporarily smear obsessed. And I'm going to add some colors to my canvas. But I'm going to add them on top of some Anita's white metallic. And I may add more. Chances are good actually. So I'm going to use favorite colors and new colors. And the new color I'm using today is an Artist Loft Neon Violet. Which reminds me a lot of my old folk art neon, but it's a lot lighter in color. I'm just going to use favorite colors, and that includes the Cobalt Blue, which is very turquoise from Artist Loft also. And the neon, excuse me, the electric blue from Arteza. Whoop, that just unblocked itself. And I, like I said, if I want more, I'll add more. This is a Venetian blue from Modern Masters. I've been thinking about this and I want some copper in here. I may add some gold. I'm definitely, definitely contemplating adding some more white to the background. I'm hoping I haven't already overstepped my comfort zone, although I may have done that. So. I keep craving using some of my magenta, and although it seems a little crazy to me right now because it doesn't really go with these colors. I'm going to try some and maybe a little bit of orange too, just for right now. All right, so I have swipe tools and I have smear tools. And I've been using these as smear tools, and they're under tools. And if you put tools in the search box, you'll come up with that. I'm going to use just as much paint as I can fit on the tip of this. I really want some pink. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay. That is a hot orchid. And I'm going to have to grab a scrape dish. I might even want a little scrape bowl instead. That's pretty cool. It makes me want some more blue. I actually really, really like that. I might tip some of this. I am going to use my little tool. Loving that pink, so I'm going to give myself a little more. And I'm using artist, excuse me, I'm using Amsterdam Black cell activator that has Minwax pre-stained wood conditioner in it. So far, so good. Really liking what I'm getting. I think I'm going to go back to using the tip. Yeah. 
I'm going to use my leftovers right down on the edge. Great colors. I, call it, I always make an assumption that if I can use great colors, I'll probably have a fairly decent chance of having something really interesting happen. I'm just going to pick and choose. I really want to use one of my little spatulas to see how that works. And that seems to work pretty well. Now I have a whole bunch of paint left there. I didn't really want to get rid of all of that white. Go back to the little tool or the big tool. What's it going to be? So there's my cell activator. This time I'm going to see if I can let it spread out a little bit. I should have used a much bigger dip dish, which is my usual. That's a cool shape. I like that. I am taking my residual paint and just putting it right in my little cup and it's beautiful. I did, I just stole a little bit of paint. I was punished by having a little tail. That's pretty cool. I'm loving the shape. So it was a pre-prime canvas. I did mention that and it was 99% dry. And I can just pick up a little bit of paint with this, with the edge of this little tool. It's another ocean going nudibranch, which is another name for some sort of sea slug. I'm going to use my leftover paint right there because I can. The name of my first book on the Amazon link. Next to my second book <laughs> called Unlimited Possibilities. Also on the Amazon link. And the Amazon link is on the link tree. The link tree is the first blue link under the video. I like that. Do I want it anywhere else? I think I want to fix this little almost mistake. Let something go right over the side. I've got a little mark here. Just want to fill that in. I like that. Should have saved more paint. I like making those loop-de-loops behind. They're pretty cool. Where do I want to put another one? <laughs> So what did I not tell you guys? Probably something, <laughs> probably everything. Um, I have over 2,000 videos and if you would like a link, let me know. And if you want to look for them, look for them on playlists, all playlists, creative playlists. When you go to my YouTube channel, you should find those categories there. If you are interested in purchasing an artwork, you should definitely contact me using the email address that's shown when you click show more underneath the link tree, you'll find that. I only used one of those little tools. I love these colors. I wish they would stay. This is fantastic. I really, really am happy with this. I might do a little tiny bit of something something right over here. So that was looking a little bit off kilter to me. 
I'm going to throw my tools in the bucket really quickly and go back to torching to release bubbles caught in the paint. If you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up, I would really, really appreciate that. That little bit of orange is great. It doesn't even need any more anywhere else. The cells are fantastic. I can't wait. My Australian flow troll is on the way. I don't know how long it'll take, but I will be comparing American flow troll with Minwax pre-stained wood conditioner in it to the Aussie flow troll and doing smears and blooms to my heart's content. Woohoo! I love it. Thank you for joining me. I love you guys. You inspire the heck out of me. I really appreciate that about you. And uh, if you want to be of assistance, please share my videos. When you watch them longer, it's a huge, huge assistance to me. Oh yeah, cool shape. Let's zoom in and try and go from end to end. I've got some really, really, really nice, very lacy, very lacy cells. I'm trying not to break my camera tripod. If I explain to you the armature that my camera is mounted on, you would understand why I say that. Cool shapes. Maybe I'm getting better at this. You think? Hopefully. All right. So, on the end screen video, in the exhibition video, in the last 20 seconds on every video, you will find the, the monthly drawing prizes included at the very beginning. And should you want to be somebody who can, should you want to help support the production of videos and, I, and continuation of my channel, look for PayPal and Patreon icons on the bottom right hand corner of my channel banner. And if you make a don donation, you will be automatically entered in the monthly drawing that happens at the beginning of the month. Well, the end, the very last day. And then the beginning is starts a new one. If you shop my Amazon link, you help me out at no added cost to you. My two books are there. I think I mentioned that. I can't remember because I can in the unlimited possibilities. My community board has tomorrow's video listed on it most times. Sometimes I forget. Then there's Facebook groups. Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Appreciation Group is for students, and I usually post tomorrow's video there too. And Expressionist Art Studio Gallery Totes and More has Shop Now button that will take you to Fine Art America. If you can't find what you're looking for, let me know with the hashtag and the file number and I will add what you're after and give you a link. If you email me, my email address is right below the video. When you click Show More underneath the link tree, it will drop down my email address and my paint pouring recipe and my cell activator recipe. If you're interested in purchasing an art artwork, use that email with the same hashtag file numbers and uh, I, I will send you a copy of the dry artwork if I have it. And um, I think everything... Okay, Teespring clothing. Spring clothing is below the video and it has my all over print leggings and all over print t-shirts and more. And it's not terribly expensive compared to Le Gallerist, which is the top link on the link tree. But it's investment quality clothing from Montreal, dresses and the like. Beautiful stuff. What else can I tell you guys? Thank you. Thank you for everything. Thank you for the donations that help keep me painting all this time. If I said that twice, you'll forgive me. I'll see you anon. I post seven days a week and Friday, Saturday and Sunday night at 10 p.m. also. Bye for now. This is Priscilla Batsell in Spring Hill, Florida at Expression Art Studio Gallery saying, come again. If you're new, please be welcomed. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe if you'd like. And if you're still here after a long time, thank you. I love you. See you soon. Hopefully. Bye for now. Priscilla out.